here. This is how the great era met its end. Just for men, auto stop. It's a breakthrough. No mix, no mess. It just codes in. And the formula shuts off at just the right color for the perfect look. What a strange thing. New, just Some sort of worm or who knows what it is. Very odd thing. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Stretching out, looking for a way down. Can you see it? It's moving. Watch it closely. Here it goes again. On the tip of my knife blade. What a strange looking thing. This is not an optical illusion. This is an actual thing. They're going to put it on the countertop. Now let's watch it on the countertop. Looks like a little piece of snot or something, but watch it move. It's alive. Whatever it is, is alive. The blob. Okay. There is no stopping Sylvia. She works out daily. She seals and stains her own deck. She even does This is a weird day. thing. When Sylvia was at a Walmart, she noticed really nasty. Her out to her car. At first I thought it was a her purse. She began a hot pursuit, chasing them through the something car. like mucus. Hey, I wasn't afraid one bit. I didn't even think about it. I thought you're not getting away with it. But it's moving. Well, police are investigating and Sylvia is eating. Living mucus. Well, she's not the only, only person who sprang into action recently. Take a look at the surveillance video. Police said it shows an 81-year-old man going into a gas station. When he does, you can see a carjacker get into the driver's side of the vehicle. Police said the driver's wife was in the passenger seat, and the carjacker threatened her with a butcher's knife. That's when what the, the hell is it? car struggles with the carjacker until he runs off. Police arrested a suspect minutes later when the couple was not hurt. All right, some other folks all over the state have been waiting for the winning numbers to the Mega Millions jackpot. People everywhere are getting their last-minute tickets today because that big payout is about 363 million bucks, and that is the biggest Mega Million jackpot in North Carolina ever. So here are the winning numbers for you. Write them down. 19, 44, 34, 9. 51 and the Mega Millions number 24. So good luck. One of your friends doesn't show up for work tomorrow. You know, I, 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 they might have called that rich. You don't know. Yeah, you know, your winning lottery ticket wasn't there. Maybe your brackets are falling apart. Yeah. So, so what do you have to look forward to? Really weird. No, I don't think that's so enough. We are nine days away from that first baseball game. Yeah, it is also the season of allergies, tree pollen allergies. Here's my knife. High counts going to continue. For a size relation thing. And Friday, mainly oak and pine pollen. We are already cooling off quite a bit. Look at these numbers, 45 in Reedsville, Pilot Mountain, where... 50 degrees right now in High Point. Let's check in live in downtown High Point. We do have mostly clear skies. 
Some wet streets out there tonight, but we do have some rain in the forecast. Now let's check in in Wilkes County at North Wilkesboro, also with mostly clear skies out there. Temperatures in the mountains and foothills last night dipping down into the 30s, and we are looking at temperatures that will be dipping down into the low 40s as we head into tomorrow. Some sort of worm. Or larva. But it doesn't appear to have any head, mouth, legs, tail. Nothing identifiable other than it looks like a blob. Very small. Brought to you by High Peak Regional Health System. Turn left. 